how we replace a piston on a chair. We're going to need WD-40, a can of this will help. We lift it all the way up, spray generously at the piston and base connection. Let it soak up over there. We're also going to spray it right where the piston connects to the mechanism, right on the interior part. What I like to do is I like to use the hammer to hammer out the piston and base. Sometimes the piston will continue to stay in the base or the piston will just fall off with the chair completely. That's why I set up a little carpet section right over here. We're going to give some light taps at first. And there we go. So now we have the piston out of the base. We're going to take a wrench. We're going to grab the piston like this. And what we do here is very, you're going to have to turn it tightly. Once it begins to tighten, untighten, it loosens up, comes right out. And that's how we change the piston out of, a, out of a chair. We're going to clean any residue left over from the WD-40. And because our piston was functional, we're going to pop it right back in. Take the office chair and place it right back on. And we're, what we want to do is we want to take a little seat. See everything is functional. And that's how we change a piston.